Homeland Security Secretary Christian Nielsen is out. Kevin McAleenan will be in as the acting secretary. And the moves are bringing some very strong reaction from 2020 Democratic candidates, such as this one. Massachusetts Senator Elizabeth Warren tweeting this. About time, Secretary Nielsen's legacy of tearing innocent families apart will follow her for the rest of her life. And she should be ashamed of the role she played. She was completely unqualified to lead DHS. That's why I voted against confirming her. Peter Ducey is live in Washington with more reaction coming from the Hill this morning. Peter, good morning. Uh, Sandra, Democrats running for president are taking a victory lap because some have been calling for Nielsen to resign for months for her role separating families at the border. So Senator Kirsten Gillibrand tweeted, I voted against Kirsten Nielsen's nomination and called for her resignation over the administration's inhumane treatment of immigrant families six months ago. What this country needs is a moral reset on immigration policies. We won't get that in this administration. Beto O'Rourke says, let's unite and do everything in our power to elect a president who will not allow her or his DHS secretary to separate families, tear gas kids, put children in desert temp tent camps, inflict irreversible damage not only on our fellow human beings, but on the conscience of this country. Kamala Harris says Kirsten Nielsen misled the American people and defended Trump's inhumane policy of separating children from their parents. It was long past time for her to go. Julian Castro adds, Secretary Nielsen has been a willing partner in the most cruel and short-sighted immigration agenda in decades. We must defeat Donald Trump and create a more compassionate and sensible immigration system that puts hashtag people first. And Cory Booker writes, we can't let this lull us into a false sense of complacency. We still have kids locked up in cages, and the cruelty won't end as long as Trump is in the White House. My Judiciary Committee colleagues and I will continue the fight. You notice these Democratic primary hopefuls are focusing exclusively on Nielsen's work at the border. We have not heard much from them about other DHS efforts like counterterror.